If you don't already know, V-Ray, one of the industry-leading render engines, is now also available for Blender, and this is a big deal. Well, technically it was released in beta a few months ago, but the official release was on July 1st, when Kaios fully launched V-Ray for Blender. But in case you haven't heard, today we're gonna take a look at this latest update and why this is gonna be a game-changer for a lot of artists. This video is sponsored by Kaios. I think everyone knows what V-Ray is at this point, so I'm not gonna bore you with introductions. Think cycles on steroids, if it has pro-level tools, massive material asset libraries, and a production tested speed and reliability. Before this latest release, Blender artists only had access through unofficial bridges. They were rough around the edges, missing the integration and polish you would expect from a Kaios product. But with the official launch earlier this year, Kaios finally opened the door to its engine inside Blender. And now, just a couple of months later, Update 1 brings major new features, like Cycles Material Conversion, Geometry Nodes Compatibility, and an ultra-realistic material library from Cosmos and much more. If you haven't tried the new VRA for Blender yet, you can grab a 30-day free trial at kaios.com slash VRA slash Blender, or check out the somewhat affordable Blender-only commercial licenses with monthly plans available 